Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel OS VFX. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a wallpaper in PowerPoint. Yes, you heard it right, a wallpaper in PowerPoint, just like this. Alright, so I have just created one more uh, slide. This is this one, which is I have created the growth plan, which I have used uh, in my previous uh, uh, videos. I have created this plan, and the video is available in my uh, channel. So I have just used this plant and put it on the wallpaper and you can use some of the text here. So anyway, I'm not going to show you how to create the plant, which is the video already available in the YouTube. So I'm just going to show you how we can create this particular wallpaper in PowerPoint. So let's start. Add a new slide, go to insert, shapes, select rectangle, draw the rectangle from one end to the other end and make it no outline and right mouse click say edit points all right so you can just click it here and you can just reduce something like this and again click on this point and you can reduce like this if you want to be more smoother right mouse click here and just say smooth points you'll be getting something like this doesn't matter it's outside so all right so this also you can just make smooth points and do something like this all right so just make it something yes all right then it's time to give the color we'll give the color later on you can see i have used uh, this particular uh, color here all right if you see format shape right i have used this particular color which is this one 175 204 and 54 so i'm just going to use the same color and just add it here all right the second one the second layer which is this layer all right so this layer i'm going to add now okay go to insert again shapes again select the rectangle draw the rectangle make it no outline all right you can just send this back and then again edit points and you can add some points here i'll just select here and right mouse click i can say add point here also add point and somewhere here as well i'll just say add point all right and then again as usual i'm just making it smooth this also i'm making it a smooth all right so you can just play with this one All right, so you can just make it some more smaller. Any shape which you feel that you're comfortable, you can just uh, make that shape here. So again, for this also, I'm going to give the color. If you see the color, I have used a light green color here, then I have used something, the shade, the green, dark green, and so on, so that it will give a, a very good effect right for this one i have used some different uh, gradient fill here for here first of all i have used the same color which i have used it here and then i have just given some darker colors okay similarly you can come here and you can just say a gradient fill right you can make it somewhat uh, edit points this is not perfectly so I can just say smooth points here don't forget to make it smooth so otherwise it will be it won't look good then all right so this is somewhat small I can make it somewhat small also here edit point I can just make this like this 
so model as Even this also, I'll just say smooth point. All right. Okay. So we have done our second part. Now it's time to do the the third one. All right. So here, let me just do some more modifications as well. This is somewhat up. So the third point I'm going to use something which is this one here all right again I'm going to use shapes draw the shape till here no outline and just send to back and you can use the same gradient fill but you can just change how you want this to be okay Again, edit points. I'm going to add some more points here, which is again, right mouse click, say add point, right mouse click, add point and smooth as this wall also, I'll make it a smooth. Just make it something. Okay, I'm just going to use the same uh, color, but then you can play with the colors here. All right. I'll add one point here also and smooth. I'll just do something like this. Okay, so we are getting the shape now. Edit point, we can just further reduce. And I have used some different colors here, all right? So I'm just going to use the same thing. here it will look something like this okay similarly I'm just going to add one small here which is this shape all right so for that one I'm going to use a oval I just draw the oval and bring it here and I'll just say gradient fill and no outline send to back Something like this okay if you want to add see I have added some more with different colors here for that I'm using till half only send to back make it no outline and edit points i will just bring this here smooth point all right so here i've used a different color here with this one which is 137 183 and 179 so i'm just going to use the same color all right and press ctrl d rotate you can just say flip horizontal and bring it here you can give more darker colors and send to back all right so here's something it look something like this again you can just 
do some more modifications also here something like this and then you can add the background which I have used the background this color so if you see here format background so I can just come here and format background I can give the same color here all right now we have added all the layers it's time to just uh, do some uh, minor corrections if you see this is very big we can just bring it down even this also right You can do more changes as you like all right so this one I want this to be up and this to be down edit points right. okay so here this is our file and this is just I've created still you can just make it more I can just add one more point here and I can reduce it all right now uh, if you see here in this one I've just created some trees and all those things so it's very easy for that I'm just going to go make it shapes and select this one freeform scribble I can just draw any tree as my as you like it whichever shape all right so th this doesn't look like a tree so I'm just going to delete and I have to do it once again all right like this straight like this and yeah make it no outline and I'm going to give some darker colors here Okay, so this one I will just say send to back. Yeah, you can just again as it says that you can just go edit points and then you can play with this one. Whatever you feel. Alright. The same thing. I have created some grass effect here for that also I'm just going to make it same scribble and you can just add something like this again shape outline no outline give this dark shape and send to back all right Apart from that one, I have just created one more uh, sun shape here. Just we can create this one, make it no outline. And I'm going to give yellow color, which is more transparent. And I can just say simply send to back. So it's up to you, uh, depend on your creativity, how you want this to be created. All right, so this is the one which you have just created. And this is the earlier one. All right. So that's it from me friends hope you like this uh, video and uh, by this time you know how to create uh, the wallpaper in powerpoint uh, see you soon with more interesting stuff uh, till then goodbye